this is the black view earbuds 2. so if you remember i reviewed the earbuds 1 a while ago and this is like the 2 version so we're gonna see the difference i don't have the earbuds 1 to compare but anyway let's compare so as you can see these are also splash proof have the touch control thing up to 20 hours you can do phone calls with these so very similar specs to earbuds one but these are a different shape so yeah okay. all right so we have a different uh, case design than before feels very uh, premium in the hand okay USB C charging nice oh that's how you open it it's like so the seal is magnetic and here are the buds themselves what else do we get in the box well in this little box here our manual this might come in handy and in this we, we just get our USB C USB-C charging cable, a pretty short one. Oh, wait, and you have the fit extra things for your ear. The, I forgot, forgot what these are called. All right, so these are the buds themselves. They feel pretty good in the hand. Made out of plastic, but of course, you know, that's perfectly fine. So I'm gonna pair these up and get back to you. All right, so the fit is actually very, very snug. So as you can see over here, it says left and right. Can't really see it because the camera has trouble focusing a uh, short distance. Anyway, all I have to do is like that. Slide them in. And it's a perfect fit. Like they're really snug. That's what I like about these earbuds. So as soon as I put them in, like when the light is flashing, that means they're um, in pair mode. Like as you, as you saw before, like the blue and red flashing lights. So as soon as I saw that, I put them on, went into my Bluetooth devices. It was down here in available devices and it was tap, press OK, and they paired. And as soon as they paired, it says like device connected. So first off, let's test some music. I mean, you guys can't hear it, but I'm gonna have to let you know exactly uh, what to, you're gonna hear. All right, so the audio quality is pretty nice actually. There's plenty of bass. Now we're gonna test the touch controls, so. Oh, it works. So the delay isn't too bad, and yeah, does the other side do something? Nope. Oh, okay, the other side does the same. Okay, next up, we are gonna call this phone and we're gonna see if we can answer the call through the touch controls using the Yumi DG S5 Pro to call my S21 Ultra. The ringtone you hear in the headphones, of course. Uh, hello, hello, testing, testing, put the phone over there to make sure that, okay. All right, let's listen to the recorded call. Uh, hello, hello, testing, testing, put the phone over there to make sure. So the audio quality is actually pretty good. I like, ignore the echo, that's because there are two phones you buy, that's normal. It's not gonna be like that when you call, when you actually call somebody. Um, so I think the audio quality is actually pretty good. Now we're gonna see if we can actually answer a call through the touch controls. We're gonna look for the manual, see if there's something like that. I couldn't find anything in the manual. So all I could really find out was just, you could just pause and unpause videos. But answering calls is something I haven't figured out. But it doesn't matter, everything else about these are great. The sound quality is great. That's pretty much all you really care about. You know, buds, right? The sound quality. Also, I really like this case. So it's really feels premium. So yeah, all I have to do is just slide them in like that. And now they are charging. You get this, this uh, in indicator over here. Okay, this tells you the battery of the actual case. So when you press this button, it tells you the, the battery of the case. Anyway, I think for the price, you're really getting great value ear pods. They do phone calls, the quality and the phone calls are decent. Watching videos, quality is really good. Feels like the Galaxy Buds even. 
So I guess not much else to say about these other than these are um, good earbuds. I like them. I genuinely like them. And I'm someone who usually doesn't like earpods. So I guess that is pretty much it. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments and I'll try to answer them. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace.